check out how Maxi put on my license plate. I got pulled over because I didn't have the license plate. It was actually right here and they couldn't see it. And that's how I put it on. Yeah, it, fl it flaps in the wind. Uh, Kimba and I are on our way to go see my dad who's at my sister's house. We're celebrating my nephew's 23rd birthday. We don't take her many places and I'm sure she's having anxiety because Kobe and Frida aren't here but my dad's gonna stay at my sister's house this weekend and so I'm taking Kimba to go stay with him at my sister's house. Where are we going? Kimba sauce. You know she has anxiety if she didn't have her greenie. Miss Thang. We don't have AC in the car. The summers are not going to be cool for us, huh? Hey, girl. Hey, watch out. <laughs> watch out. There you go. You're such. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. I love you. Look at her web feet. She's a swimmer. She's a swimmer. Mm -hmm. All right, we got some big plans today, guys. Oh, is it all going to be? It needs to be in 4K so you can see the perfect little fizz. Anyway, big day for us today. We're going to where? Highway 245 to go check out that property um, with my dad. We're going to go hop the fence and check that property out to see if we should invest. He said we could, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The guy, he the owner said. He didn't say. Um, I cut it out of the last vlog, but he did say in that conversation that we could hop on over and check it out. Check it out now. The police are freaking out. Do something dumb. Dude, that's Nick! What the hell? I thought they were pulling Nick over. I did too! Uh, lazy ass cop just wants to get home, piece of shit. There it is. <laughs> as long as I got you, baby. Is split? What? I have boxes on it. Nick, Nick's flexing on Mooney. All right, we're going to check out this ranch. Eight plus acres. We don't have the key. He said we can go in here, so we're not we're not actually breaking in. Anymore. Okay. Just don't step on the the barbed wire, Bubba. Careful. Oh, I'm good. Oh, I'm good. Scared me. We get to climb back up this. Just go all the way down there. Yeah. Dude, <laughs> we get to come back up this. Dude. It's gonna be super fun. Good thing you have your camel back. How's that? This place is sick, dude. This place is fucking sick. I would, I would fucking make you know. Oh. Coyote poop. Eat it. Lick it. No, you spit on it. You spit on it? That's how you identified poop? Yeah. You scrubbing speed? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> what are you doing? Wow, it's gorgeous. Holy shit. Dude, this is, I would live here, bro. I don't know These are cow pies. Are you sure? Grizzly yeah. cow is here, bro? Grizzly cow. Is this, is this his stomping ground? Dude, that's a definite grizzly cow shit. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, my God. Dude, this road's huge. And but, this is actually a real good road for, these, uh, for this kind of fucking area. Bro. For these here parts? Yeah. Beautiful tree, beautiful tree. I love how no one has the patience to like wait in the group. Everyone just bails. What's that? Could be badger. 
That was not a rattlesnake. That was a gardener snake. There are no gardener snakes here, bro. I can, I can, I don't know what it was. I Where are you going? I guarantee it was a rattle. Oh, uh, Garrett's lost. Is a rattlesnake? So I guess this is the house bat, huh? Dude, this is sick, bro. God, dude, I don't know why you wouldn't live here, dude. Dude, this is like serious. Dude, we could set up and fucking... Is that you making noises? Bigfoot every Dude, Bigfoot definitely embarked on ground, bro. We that really wasn't you making those noises? Did you hear it? What? What did it sound like? Did it sound like a donkey cow type noise? Yeah. That's Oh my god. Dude, you're shaking your pants, bro. <laughs> Look at you got a free yeah, boulder. Oh, that's <laughs> <laughs> Look at there's a free helmet over there. This well, you just drill the well like up there if you could, actually, and then you'd have a water, you know, a water reservoir. I don't like it. I don't like the house pad here. Oh, I like it up there. You can see like you don't want out the windows there. overlooking. All right, so this becomes your motorcycle track. Yeah, a little mini Dude, one. This is your land. You can chop down these trees, but then you have a bunch of people probably protesting. I, I don't know if there's oaks out here, but California oaks you gotta. Yeah, oaks, you gotta get permits. Yeah. Permit oaks? I mean, this is where we'd stick the fifth wheel. Maybe. How do you know what's down there? If you said there's already a landing, I guarantee this is it. Yeah, this is. This what is the house. This about? is the house pad. Yeah. Except for that rock. You gotta move the rock. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Rock's massive. <laughs> that rock is not moving. <laughs> what's out there? <laughs> There's another rock. Big rocks. I think a, a name is coming for the, land, for the ranch. Big rock. Big rock. Big rock ranch. End of the road. Yeah, it's definitely the end. I don't know where they all went. Look at this. I'm guessing I had to see. Yeah, this would be hella fun on the dirt bikes. Poison ivy, poison oak. Yeah, There's definitely poison oak up here, but uh, you, you can have I think it's more down towards the water. Hey, is there a creek down there? You allowed to burn? You have to get a permit. Oh, you can have like a little campfire out here. What about that? That you can burn no. it. You can, but you got to get a permit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, I think we do rain catches too, dude. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be catching tons of rain out here. You will. And then what's the other thing? No, we won't. <laughs> you catch rain. What you do? Yeah. Like yeah. Propane, propane and, and, rain catch and septic, right? Propane, propane and we, septic. Uh, went to the mountains. For power, we we'll here. fill up that. Yeah. Yeah. Propane. Well, the power cool. comes from the road. The there is power up there? Yeah. It comes down to this property? Oh, you got to get a transformer, he said. Yeah. And then the only, well, then you have to, what, submit like a request to the city or yeah. the county or whatever. And then, and then they have to approve it. And then you got to run the lines, and it's got to be some safety issues with like a bush, right? Shoot, but our fifth wheel will fit perfect. But like you said, it, you could also put a pad up the top. So that I'd put a view. pad up there, honestly. Tiny home up there. Yeah, tiny home works too. How much for water? Can we just get some shovels? Be like, for, I don't know. For us to come out here and do it, it'd be like, probably like three grand. That's three, you. At what? least three to five. But to just put the pump in, <laughs> but pump somebody else has to stuff. drill. Uh, How far down you would you have to drill on the side of a mountain like this? A hill, though. Not far. Not far. So there's be natural water with an incline right here of lower ground down there too. Or? Be like probably 100 max. 100. You're and about that's... to get a mosquito bite on that skull. Dude, you're getting scolded. They don't bite me. Scolded. No. No. Would this be pretty dope? Can't you light these on fire? Yeah. Try. Really? Ah! Ah! Spot. <laughs> Not that moist spot. Oh God, dude, there are mosquitoes, dude. I just want to know why the. Uh, this is all. This is all I uh, hear. Right? Where are the bats? They're everywhere. They're the like, even the the house, I'm gonna slow mine. Yeah. <laughs> I did that with my. You don't forget your helmet, bro. Moist. <laughs> what do you think, Justin? Moist. There's like a nice little path down there. If you go, you can see the other. If you can get you your fifth wheel down here, it'd be sick. But I don't. <laughs> down that road, I don't think you're gonna get through the gate. I think you'd be surprised. Dad has 
hasn't seen the fifth wheel. The thing turns pretty well. <laughs> Does it not? Yeah, for the dings we did too. Yeah. I mean, once it comes down here, though, it's not coming <laughs> it's not back coming up. Yeah. Yeah. That's for sure. It's coming down, and that's it. It and, stays here. And I would probably build, like, a canopy over it. Oh, shit, I left my key on my bike. Oh, my God. That's what I heard. All right, fastest one here. <laughs> yeah, right. I'd grab... Uh, the CBR uh, the 600, and I'd rip the sh down. Think you get there and catch them? I'd catch them. <laughs> I'd catch whoever was on that. Dude, I would knock them off with my shoe. Dude, Dude look at that ant. Oh, my God. That ant just got big. Why are you spitting on ants, bro? I don't like them. You're gross. Dang, Bubba, we could have horses, cows. chickens. Dude, you got cows. So I'm, I obviously, guess, I roamed through you. Yeah. You might see grizzly cow. You might chill with you. Dude, a freaking cow. If if there was a cow coming up here, Jane would be so stoked. She'd be like, come here. You'd be like, bro. So She'd be like, come here. <laughs> just think about it in the morning, just with your cup of coffee. Just... I got this. If anybody's up. Here's the sun. We could definitely have a vineyard. Knock down some of these. This is a great vineyard area. Oh. I think the fifth wheel would make it. You go see oh, the, the wheels are pretty narrow on it. Okay. Yeah, it would be pretty, pretty risky, actually. <laughs> would you watch? Yeah, I'd watch it fall off the side right there. Oh! I need to make this corner, dude. This corner's easy. You're, you're making not making that corner, <laughs> for sure. Really, this one? You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to like cut those trees out and extend the path. Well, here they can, the cutting truck out, the cutting truck, the truck can cut out to here, <laughs> the right? The cutting truck out, dude. Yeah, the cutting truck, dude. This first section from the you get Ghosty up here, dude, and he can actually fucking do the whole fucking outdoor thing. Oh, yeah, huh? Yeah. Right here? Yeah. You just need to flatten this a little bit more. This area? I mean, look at that view. I think it'd be better here. Take down yes. that tree. And it wouldn't, you wouldn't have to deal with... Don't take down the tree. It's pretty blissful out here. But... The thing that, that worries me, well, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not what, what were you going to say? Is the seclusion. Just going crazy? No. What if someone murders me? Oh. They're going to they're gonna have to come with some pretty heavy guns. That's what I'm thinking. Right. Yeah, gotta be... We got enough to fend off some people, but if an army's coming to kill us, army's yeah, coming to they, kill us. We could get a helicopter. Are you serious? Yeah. So we're thinking a helicopter dropping it in? <laughs> Hey, Why don't we just cut the road out right there, dude? Well, there goes my clean feet. Well, I can almost guarantee you there's a company that'll put it down there for you. Bro. Yeah, it's called Maxi Enterprises. <laughs> so, Dad, what are your uh, thoughts? Uh, well, it looks nice. There's gonna be some work. Who cares? You know, if to make it costs. livable, but I don't know I don't how know. much. There's just poop. There, you gotta have, uh, <laughs> like you said, water. The water tank is an interesting idea. Well, you have a well, and then it pumps oh, it to the tank, the and then you have yeah. the gravity-fed tank. Right, which gives you or you just get a water pressure. tank, you fill it, and you'll get a rain catch. You'll, you'll get the water. <laughs> Everybody does that shit. It's, I find somebody that when you're riding, somebody that lives up on this road, they're always out, dude. Hey, dude. Yeah, but as a business? How do you poop? I like that. idea. <laughs> you think it could work? I think so. I don't know. You'd have to build up the clientele, because you're looking at a specific group, the motorcycle people that want to come here i go directly towards our own audience yeah yeah i mean i already have like 20 30 people i know yeah off the top but that i mean would it. you would get other people too well even sure. after then why wouldn't you airbnb later let airbnb but pick up premium. all the the bullshit work of renting it and paying for it and oh, charging the people all the well stuff. actually that's an interesting point because then your number is wrong because i'd be Coming out here, teaching them how to ride, supplying them with the motorcycle, yeah. helmet, airbag vest. Right. No, but when you supply the place with food, you when know, your clientele like, runs out, what? you're gonna need something. Then yeah, I would go, I would go to Airbnb after like, that. Not enough. <laughs> well, the bike I got no for food. free. No food. Airbag vest free. Helmet, no food. You don't need to supply the food, you nutty. Actually, I would not give them food. Maybe snack. Let them get food. Like, food. Right uh, yeah. Nobody yeah. expects to for you to. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you don't walk into Richard's house and they're like. A bed and Where's breakfast? the shrimp and scallops? You come here to ride. That's it. <laughs> and a freaking, what do you call it? Yeah. Air fryer in there. I mean, and then also you may be trying to tell them, now listen, listen that's not good to eat. They eat this. And <laughs> like, they'll leave a bowl of fruit. <laughs> Too bad I won't be retired yet to help you. Garrett, yeah. what's this for? Those are nitrogen shots. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I love that bike. Yeah, it's really, it's really <laughs> Like, beautiful. it's so unique huh? and I love it too. Oh, I love it too. It's so pretty. Beautiful. That's like the one Captain America rode, huh? Right, it does look like Captain yeah, America. Yeah, it's like the Captain America bike, except... It, it is the Captain America bike. Wait, Justin, was, uh, what do you guys wow. think? What do you three boys think? 
a lot of work, and that trailer yeah, is going to be a, you're not gonna get that trailer a down pain there. to get down there. Well, I think Justin's right, though, moving dirt. And just yeah, no, yeah, we'd have to clear that. Oh, you know right, what? And then right you've got there. a huge truck with a winch, and you just lower it down. That's how you do it. That's how you Damn. winch it down. Even though I like the idea of a helicopter. Directly. <laughs> <laughs> just hit up your boy with the G5. Oh, yeah. yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah you gotta look at the weight. Off. You know, I got a parachute for my damn thing. Just drop off the bag. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's a thought. Dude, if it fails, I'll buy it off you with the fifth wheel and I'll live here. Ah! <laughs> 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 I'm down to look into the loans. I'm gonna see what I can poke yeah. around and. You know, why not? It's actually a great idea to look at the loans and see. What the deal is? What the deal? What what's available? It you know, may like be out of the question, you know. Or it's like, how can we turn it down? <laughs> it's so good. It's gonna be a fun project. Who doesn't like some fun? Keep the cameras rolling. It's gonna be hard. We have a place to vacation to with mosquitoes. If you start to recognize them, then you can name them. No mosquitoes. <laughs> Even though they're only little. Well, my own little pool of water. mosquitoes are seasonal, bro. So it's not like yeah, it's not year, year round, you know. All right, well, we can we can go to Wells Fargo at least because my bank doesn't exist here. Yeah. Yeah, Hanford, it does. They have a city bank? Mm -hmm. Where's Hanford? Uh, 15 minutes out by city. Oh. That yeah, that's why I got city bank. Yeah, I was able to. Costco. We didn't go to Costco in Hanford. My city bank charged from Costco. Yeah, wait, hold on. Because that's where they We've me always go, talked about issues. it because it's less busy. <laughs> all right, that's all she wrote. We'd have to drop For in. now. We need Starlink. Starlink charges $500. What are your thoughts on the property after looking at it? And after is the ride home, mainly. I don't know. I was just thinking about like. We got the baby back. The baby's back home. The land. You know, cause that's literally what we're buying. It's just land. And it's not like. I mean, I would have loved to walk the eight acres. Obviously, we didn't have time. But also, we don't. Go on. Our ability to Go actually. On. Our ability to even walk the eight acres is difficult. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah. It's not like the land we're buying is like nice and flat. I also don't think it's very. Uh, I don't think it's very stable land. Um, I do think like if there's a ton of rain up there, water is gonna run down. Did you it. find out it was on the San Andreas Fault? No. Is it? No, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. But I was just thinking like rain, mud is gonna move down. Rocks are gonna come down. Like shit's gonna pile up, move around, and there's big rocks there. Yeah. Like, huge. One Even my dad rock was like, rolls down or whatever, and it's through a turn. And there's so many good areas out there where there's just like flat plots. And like, if you can buy like a flat plot with like four or five acres, even, you know, lot less, you know, two or three acres, even shit. Flat land, nice area. Well, then you might as well have it in Three Rivers. No, Three Rivers isn't really flat, and that is mosquito heaven. Better to have like the nice dry. I like the dry area out there. Hi, man. Love you. Die. Okay. So I just, I just foresee. I thought it was even like it was, it was a dilemma to potentially even get the fifth wheel down. Yeah. And it's at that point, if like. It's a dilemma to get it down. It's a dilemma to get water. It's a dilemma to get up there. You know what I mean? It would be better to, like, have a place near the base. And, like, those dope little pastures around there, like, there's areas there. Oh, yeah. Like, TC and I went a completely different way. We went the way that... Oh, do you know that way? That was when we went to see the camping spot with her and Philip, And we saw, like, that's... That's that a little, the graveyard? like... graveyard? That's a little, like, hills have eyes, though. You know? Yeah, like, remember the graveyard? Those people, like, cults out there. For sure, calls out there. I'm at Lowe's right now. We're gonna go get a gazebo because we were actually gonna do the half barrel, like the half wine barrels, um, which they have at Lowe's right now. And then get the cement, fill it with cement, get the wooden poles, just do all this. Okay, it stopped recording, but um, 
collectively speaking, like with the with the half wine barrels, the cement, um, the the tarp to go over, all the tools and everything we needed, the supplies we needed to do that, it was going to be at least two hundred dollars or more. I'm going to show you the gazebo that we found at Lowe's. I have like a mushroom on my head. Look at that. <gasps> oh, that's a problem. That's definitely here, a guys. problem. Yeah. It is. All right, we're here. We're on it. This is it. Well, it doesn't come with what's inside. But this is that. I mean, yeah, that looks nice as shit. Right from here and going across, we can hang lights from Costco. Oh. And then we can put our plants. Let's see, this is only Ook 128. That's nice. That looks so nice. We're going to get it. What, the gazebo? Yeah. Oh, this is just for the bench. Yeah. This is for the table. <laughs> no, we're not getting this. Oh, all right. How do we go about uh, buying Getting this? this. <laughs> you want to get one? Yes, yeah. please. Okay. Only way it could fit. Wait, I'll meet you at home, honey, before I go get mom. I'm going to go cycle gear. Okay. I took the head off the passenger and everything. Worth it. Okay, I, I should not be driving around like this with this big ass gazebo, but I went to Target because we went in to get the gazebo at Lowe's and I don't know if any of you guys, well I'm sure all of you know this, especially the vets, but if you're a vet, they give you a 10% discount and <clears throat> on a purchase like this, I was like, oh, dime bags with us, dime bags a vet. Like, let, can you get a dime bag in here so we can get 10% because save our money where we can save our money like always so the guy ended up just giving it to us he's like don't worry about it like you're fine I'll just give it to you and I told him I was like oh what do you what do you like from Starbucks because if people do things like that for you like it recycles itself like karma recycles itself so I went to Starbucks he says he likes anything mocha so I got him a venti mocha frappuccino from Starbucks I'm about to go take it back to Lowe's Wait, show them what you did. Okay, so Frida. Frida is like Frida, with our neighbors. Frida won't stop the, oh, oh, that's nice. Yep. There's you can, Frida. You can see her just great. She so, is so, great. She <laughs> is great. This is my angel. Anyway, show them what to do. Someone to do it. So anyways, this is vinegar. She wants to eat their dog. Like she no, wants and to. and they have ducks over there. So will eat her. Anyway, come on, come on, come on. So we're gonna, so the point of the story is every time we're over there, or every time she's over there, she needs to be disciplined. And this is the discipline. Does Kelly even like it? He holds it. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did that not taste too good? Where's the ball? Oh. Where's the ball? <laughs> <laughs> Where's the ball? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 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 laugh. Oh, God. Get the ball. Get the ball. Give me it. Give me it. <laughs> Get the ball, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> My baby! Good boy. Come here. You can drop the ball. Oh. <laughs> okay. How many times are we going to try? How many times? Come here. We don't need the ball. No ball. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. I feel bad. Hi, monkey. <gasps> Yeah. Totally fine. <laughs> oh, I think oh. the cannon might be filled with vinegar. Um, yeah. <laughs> and everywhere I go!